Thank goodness. I was sure I was finished.
Allied infantry always welcome the sight of a Sherman tank. Its combination of speed, firepower and quick repair made it an invaluable ground weapon. The sheer number of Shermans in the field usually allowed Allied generals to count on armored superiority. However, not all the Sherman tank specs were ideal. It was thinly armored and caught fire easily. In addition, its cannon was not large enough to pierce the more heavily armored enemy tanks, a weakness not shared by the German Tiger. Fortunately, evolving teamwork between ground spotters, artillery and the Army Air Force meant no Tiger was impenetrable, thus helping the Shermans rule the day. As usual, Jimmy, I've got good news and bad news. Analysis of the documents you retrieved from the Luftwaffe Detachment 9 supports your conclusion that the Germans have designed a new type of combat aircraft, a jet fighter. Additional intelligence confirms that this new plane has already gone into production at the Gotha facility outside the city of Duisburg, 100 miles inside the German border. The documents hint at plans for a bomber, similar in design, using something they call flying wing technology. Interestingly enough, it appears that early intelligence places a man by the name of Rudolf Ulbricht von Sturmgeist at the helm of this fighter's production. We've discovered he was touring the Lorient shipyard facility at the time of your visit not too long ago. Unfortunately, that's the good news. The bad news is Field Marshal Montgomery's Operation Market Garden has begun in Holland and is fast turning into a disaster. The 101st Airborne has managed to secure its target bridges at Eastwick and Vegel, but the 82nd has been fought to a stalemate near Nijmegen Bridge. Our forces are bogged down outside Arnhem. Germany seems determined to keep us from pushing past the River Vaal. Intelligence reports that Hitler has authorized massive reinforcements, placing the defeat of the Allied forces in the Market Garden campaign above the security of Germany itself. A counter-strike from General Field Marshal Modell's forces in the area is imminent. Your assignment is to make your way to the city of Arnhem and meet with an operative who can smuggle you into Emmerich. There, find out what the hell the Germans are up to. All available Allied aircraft have been diverted to support other Market Garden initiatives, so you'll have to make your way to Arnhem on foot. With Monty's plan in a tenuous state, I suggest you get there as quickly as you can. That's all, Lieutenant. Jimmy, we've got good reason to believe Nijmegen Bridge is rigged to blow. And seeing as you've got no choice but to cross her tonight, how about you go ahead and disarm a few of those detonators for your new pal Tarker, huh? Das Auto, das wir eben kontrolliert haben, da war irgendwas faul. Ja, stimmt. Was war da los? Nur die hohen Tiere fahren hier nachts durch. Saukalte Wind. Warte mal, bis es hier Winter ist. Ah! Eindringling! Ah! Ah!
Get off that! 